so today we are going to be making brownies. Here's what you need. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees and then get your pan. Hi! Grab all of your ingredients. Reach really far back there in the cabinet to get that oil. Grease your pan. Oh, I need a bowl. I need a bowl. No, that's my popcorn bowl. <laughs> okay, we'll use this bowl. We're making very homemade from scratch brownies, as you can see, mm -hmm. from Pillsbury. Yep. They have the best scratch made brownies out there. Except for her actual scratch made brownies, those are better. I've never made scratch. Never mind, Jenny, please cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> You've never made scratch made brownies? I don't think so. Oh, I feel like my whole life's been a lie. All right. Brownie daddies aren't. Interesting. They're not? Your, your buds? They're not from scratch? No! They're from a mix. And he just added the nuts. Oh, I feel cheated. <laughs> then you're going to add your oil and then your water. Add your two eggs. Oh, and don't forget to ride on the struggle bus for a few minutes. That's the most important step. <laughs> Soon. We will have a bigger kitchen. <laughs> Spoiler alert, we're moving. Haha, <laughs> surprise. Search for a spoon that fits your needs. Welcome to our baking show. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna just. And mix it. You can do your workout while you're doing it. So then when you eat it, it's okay because you work down. That's a good tip. Yep. Okay, do your leg lift. Let me get a real shot of what you're doing. I missed your, there it is. Oh yeah. Really get the whole body in there. Yep. Yeah. I was gonna add music here, but then decided it's way better like this. <laughs> put in it? I use pecans and everything. Pecans. Southern staple. To me, they are. She just use eyeball on that? Yeah. Okay. Eyeball in it. Okay. Pour your batter with nuts or without into your grease pan. Now we got some fluff. Look at that. See that? How pretty? You can add as many dollops of this not daisy sour cream but marshmallow fluff as you want. We added six, but you know, go wild. Okay, now we're gonna try, try this. Ooh, it doesn't, it doesn't ooze very well. This is a technique that we learned on the Food Network. <laughs> it's called schmear. And then when you're done, pop it in the oven. She likes to live dangerously and not use oven mitts, but you should be safe. Well, when I take it out, I use oven mitts. Boom. So we're gonna set it for 30. Okay, that's good. Because I know this oven is a little, it's a good oven, but that's it. Okay. Then we will be back. After 30-ish minutes, you are ready to let it cool for what feels like an eternity and then slice and enjoy. They might not look like Food Network brownies, but they were delicious. Thanks for watching, y'all. See you next week. Oh,